Hello friends, in this video we will see how to use the VLOOKUP function or the formula in Google Spreadsheet to generate reports and particularly have images in our reports. So let's see, now in this spreadsheet I have two sheets, the first sheet is data where my data is there in a table and in the next sheet I have a student profile report where I want to generate the report from this data. So now, first of all, in this first sheet data, we will see how to insert the image. Image insertion is very important in this because there are two options available. Now, I have already inserted the images for roll number 2 to 5. In the first row, there is no image. I will show you how to insert. But click in the cell where you where you want to insert the image then go to menu insert menu then image then again in image in cell there are two options here image in cells and image over cells we want the image in cells so uh, choose the first option image in cell then Go to the location where your photo is. If it is in Google Drive, select this option. Uh, and if it is in your PC, then browse. Choose the first option. So I have kept the photos on my desktop in a folder. Select the photo of the student. Click on open. is uploaded. Our data is ready. Now we will see how to uh, generate a report by using VLOOKUP. So I want a filter for this uh, report generation. So here it is. I have already created a filter. Uh, let also see how to may use data validation for our roll number for our filter. Click in this cell where you will insert the roll number. Go to data, then data validation, then list of item, type here 1, comma 2, comma 3, comma 4, comma 5. Select reject input, show validation help test. Select roll number from the drop down. This will be the help text for data entry. Click on save. So now we have a drop down here for the roll numbers. This way we will create data validation for the roll numbers. We now select a roll number. Let it be 2. Now I will show how to use the VLOOKUP function. Uh, click here. Name. We want name of the student here. Equal to. Formula starts with equal sign. So equal sign. Then VLOOKUP. This is the name of the function. Formula. Bracket. Now we want look a value from this table so what we are looking for we are looking for roll number two there are four <coughs> criteria in the vlookup function the first criteria is what we are looking for we are looking for roll number two so click this cell then comma now in which range we are looking it we are looking in this data sheet from where to where this is our data our data range will omit this 6 so now by omitting this 6 we have extended our data range to the till the end of the sheet we have added the rows 
to our data till the end of the hit where it is where it ends and third criteria is the column number we are looking for name the names are in column 2 this is our da data range this is the first column this is the second this is third and this fourth we are looking for name it is in two. so we will type 2 then we want an exact match we are looking roll number in this column this column the roll numbers are unique there are there are no repetition so we want exact match we will type 0 as the four criteria in this formula then we will complete the bracket we'll enter so now we got the roll number of a name of the roll number to student if we will change it to three the name will change the same way we will type a formula here in, in this cell for date of birth. So we look up, we are looking for this value, our data range, go to data sheet, select the range, we will omit 11, comma. now date of birth in th column number 3, so type 3. Zero. We are looking for exact match. Enter. Now we want the photo. Now instead of typing uh, typing the formula again, I will copy this formula. Copy. Don't take equal sign. You copy the text next to equal sign. Control C. Then escape click in this cell where you want the photo type equal to control v paste the formula now in this formula change these three to four because the photo in is in column number four enter you got the photo now the roll number will be the same as this one there is no need to use the vlookup formula you can have this value here whenever we will change this value in the filter cell it will be here for that equal to click on this cell enter now whenever i will change this it will also change it will the value in this cell will be same whatever the value in this cell so now we can see that as we change the roll number the data will change according to the data in this table so this was a demo of how to use vlookup functions for looking the images uh, thank you for watching this video